Now I want to show you some photographs of some animals that you have never probably seen before. In fact, some of them are so weird that I'm going to read something about them. Oh, before I do that, I'm going to show you an animal that you are familiar with. That's actually a clownfish and an, the anemone it lives in um, among the poisonous tentacles. And the clownfish was the um, hero of a movie that many of you know. So you probably call it by another name. Passing over fantastic photos. So I can show you this page. And let me read a little bit about this. Most of the sea creatures we know live along the shores where water meets land and in the upper sunlight zone of the open ocean. But more than 60% of our planet is covered by seawater more than a mile deep and it is largely unexplored. Here are some of the strange creatures we have found there. This one is called an anglerfish. Anglerfish have huge heads and giant mouths filled with sharp teeth. The females have a piece of their body hanging above their mouths like a fishing pole. Tipped with a lure of luminous flesh, it brings in prey close enough to be caught. This animal over here is called a lanternfish. A lanternfish is a deep water fish that gets its name because it can produce light in the dark ocean depths. The light is given off by tiny organs in the fish in a chemical process known as bioluminescence. This is called a fang tooth fish. The scary looking fang tooth is only about six inches long, but its teeth are the largest compared to its body of any animal in the world. And this scary looking animal is called a vampire squid. A vampire squid lives two miles below the surface. These small sea creatures have eyes that are the largest of any animals on Earth compared to its size. They can draw their dark webbed arms over themselves like a vampire's cloak. 